If you use AWS, what's the best way to securely access your AWS resources? One option is to use a VPN like AWS Client VPN, but the setup process can be quite involved. An alternative is a zero trust solution like Twingate. In this short video, I'll walk through how in just a few minutes you can set up secure access to AWS using Twingate with just a single line of code. If you haven't already, head over to twingate.com and sign up for a free account. Click through a few steps to complete the signup process and you should see a home screen like this one. The first thing we'll do is to add a remote network, which is where we want to connect to, which can be the cloud, on-prem, or your home network. In this case, we'll choose AWS in the drop-down menu and give it a descriptive name like DevVPC. Separating access to development, staging, and production environments is a common use case for Twingate. The remote network will now be created, including two automatically generated connectors with random names. Connectors are pieces of software that we install on the remote network in order to enable remote access. Choose one of the connectors and click on Deploy Connector. This will take you to the connector's configuration page. Connectors can be deployed in a variety of ways, including as an AMI. In this example, I'll show how to use the Linux deployment method. The next step is to generate tokens. Click on Generate Tokens, which will prompt you to re-authenticate using the account you used to sign up for Twingate. After authenticating, you'll come back to the connector configuration page and see a couple of tokens have been generated. Scroll down to step three and you'll see a command was automatically generated. We'll run this later to deploy the connector. Next, launch an EC2 instance where you'll deploy the connector. In this case, I have an Ubuntu VM, but we support all major Linux distributions. Connect to it using whichever method you like. And now we will run the one and only line of code that's needed. Head back to the Twingate connector and copy the command that was automatically generated. Paste it into the shell and run the command. After a minute or so, the command will complete and you should see that the connector is now connected with green dots indicating the connection status. And that's it. We now have a secure connection to our AWS VPC. The only thing left to do is to add some resources and install the Twingate client to access them. I'll show some example resources to illustrate, but you can add any resource you like. Here, I'll launch Jenkins. In step three, choose the same subnet where you deployed the Twingate connector. You can also disable auto assign public IP. We can connect to the resource using just the private IP address. As you can see, there's no public IP address, and as expected, the resource is not accessible via the private IP address. However, let's add it in the Twingate admin console as a resource. Here, I've given everyone access, but you can also add more granular rules. Lastly, download the Twingate client app. We have apps for Mac, Windows, Linux, iOS, and Android. I'll show how it works on a Mac, but the steps are similar on other platforms. After downloading and opening the Twingate app, you'll be prompted to enter the network name. This is the name you chose when you signed up. Click through and follow the prompts to log in using the account you used when you signed up. After logging in, you'll see the Twingate icon light up, along with a list of the resources you have access to. Now that you're signed into Twingate, you can access the resource via just the private IP address. And that's it. No other configuration required. Once a connector is set up, it's really easy to add more resources just by following the same steps. You can also add port restrictions. The same connector and client app provides secure access to all the resources you set up. If you also run things on GCP or on-prem, you can use Twingate as a single solution to manage your hybrid or multi-cloud architecture. Just follow similar steps to deploy connectors on each network or use our API to configure everything programmatically. And as the end user, Twingate's client app is all you need to get secure access to all of your resources. Join us at forum.twingate.com to share and discuss with our community.